Hello and welcome to Smart Teaching. In our today's class, we are going to discuss future continuous tense. In what different situations we can use the sentences of future continuous tense, how to make positive sentence, how to make negative sentence, and how to make interrogative sentence of future continuous tense. We are going to discuss all these points in our today's class. When should we use the sentences of future continuous tense? Future continuous tense is used to show an action or activity that will be in progress at a particular moment in future. This is the important point. For example, Australia and India will be playing cricket match at 4 p.m. tomorrow. 4 p.m. tomorrow is a particular moment when the action of playing cricket match will be going on. It will be in progress. The match will start at 2 p.m. tomorrow. Cricket match does not get over within one or two hours. If this match starts at 2 p.m. tomorrow, then definitely at 4 p.m. tomorrow, the activity of playing cricket match will be in progress. It will be going on. So you can make a sentence, Australia and India will be playing cricket match at 4 p.m. tomorrow. How to make a positive sentence? It depends upon the subject. If the subject is I or we, then use helping verb shall be plus V1. V1 means first form of verb plus ing plus object. Then the sentence will become I shall be playing cricket. We shall be playing cricket. But in modern English, almost all the speakers of English language use the helping verb will be in all these subjects, including I and we. You can make sentence, I will be playing cricket. We will be playing cricket. He will be playing cricket. She will be playing cricket. It will be playing cricket or it'll be playing cricket. You can use contraction. You will be playing cricket or you'll be playing cricket. They will be playing cricket or they'll be playing cricket. Alan will be playing cricket. Alan and Mary will be playing cricket. How to make a negative sentence? It is very simple. All what you need to do is put not between shall and be or will and be. Then the sentence will become I shall not be playing cricket. We shall not be playing cricket. He will not be playing cricket. She will not be playing cricket. It'll not be playing cricket, contraction. You'll not be playing cricket. They'll not be playing cricket. Alan will not be playing cricket. Alan and Mary will not be playing cricket. How to make interrogative sentence? Bring helping verb, shall or will at the beginning of the sentence. Then the sentence will become Shall I be playing cricket? Shall we be playing cricket? Or you can use will with I and we. Then the sentence will become Will I be playing cricket? Will we be playing cricket? Will it be playing cricket? Will he be playing tennis? Will she be playing tennis? Will she be reading a book? Will you be playing cricket? Will they be playing football? Will Alan be playing tennis? Will Alan and Mary be playing tennis? 
let us see a few examples. What will the teams be doing in the playground? Pakistan and Australia will be playing cricket match on next Sunday. What will the flying ball be doing for the next few moments? In the picture you can see a white flying ball. What will this flying ball be doing for next few moments? It is hit very hard by the batsman. So you can make a sentence. The ball will be flying for next few moments. What will the eagle be doing with the fish after some time? The eagle will be flying after catching a fish. It will be eating the fish after some time. What will the teacher be doing after 10 minutes? The teacher will be teaching next topic after 10 minutes. She will not be giving punishment. What will the passengers be doing after some time? The passengers will be coming out of the plane after some time. Later on some of them will be waiting in the airport for their luggage. In this way you can use a sentence of future continuous tense to show an activity that will be in progress at a particular moment in future. I suggest to you to watch this video more than 10 times. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.